Over the years, I keep coming back to the same sketch. I dreamed of it years ago and still keep coming back to it again and again. In that dream, a girl was sitting on a hill made of skulls that were circled by a railway. But the train would never come. Sometimes she is smiling. Sometimes she sat. Sometimes I changed her posture, but usually I preferred not to draw the railway. Because the train would never come. I kept skipping classes in art school. I'd waste time on live journal, drink beer and do graffiti instead. Still, I became an artist, but now skin is my canvas and needles are my brushes. Tattoos have always been a part of human culture. Ash rubbed into a scar, initiation through pain, a way to proclaim one's status in society. Through tattoos, I study different social aspects, the graphic language and the cultural code. After a few years, this endless repetition of the sketch became tiresome. I started sinking deeper in the routine, a vicious circle. The sketches vary, but the actions were still the same. This discord is real. It's always been with me. I'd always find something new in my art before, but now I ask myself, why do I keep doing this? I'd like to rethink the whole process, maybe try an experiment. If you're watching this film, then perhaps it has been successful. But let's start from the basics, the process of creating a tattoo. Let's go. Tattooing used to be done on a clear skin, but these days, a sketch is printed out and transferred with the tattoo machine. What if we use the AR? We can upload the image and transfer it to the skin. If we manage to fixate the AR image on the skin, it becomes the stencil, and we will be able to create a new tattoo. A casting was arranged, and meant to do a tattoo on someone's back and look for a volunteer. But it was tricky to find a person ready to lend such a prominent part of himself. Finding a suitable and quiet location was just as hard. Well, the girl that agreed didn't have any previous experience with tattoos. She wasn't sure about this whole idea and made it clear that she might end up changing her mind. There's no way to know beforehand if this new technology can become a part of this sacral process. Still, here are the AR glasses and the software for tattoo design. The AR developers were skeptical about the whole idea. It's hard to believe that this will work, but we'll take our chances. It's the only way to break the vicious circle.
Normally my sketches are quite ironic. But this time I had to rethink my approach. The technology was not perfect. I was concerned that the projection might shift during transfer and the tattoo would end up looking distorted. To avoid that, I decided to model the final drawing during the tattooing process. I ended up picking the flower design. A flower can look imperfect, yet still organic. Parts of the image will be uploaded to the AR glasses and then projected to the skin, one by one. The final design would only emerge at the end. this composition is presented differently. If so, I'll be able to see that realm using the AR glasses. 